Hi guys, my name is Kevin. Welcome to or back to my channel. This is try number two to try and film this video. Basically, I film everything on my phone and my phone ran out of storage. So it ended my video. So we had to like rearrange a bunch of things, delete a bunch of videos. So I was also filming a comp week in my life. Don't really like how that turned out. So I think I'm just going to scrap that video. And I have three comps after spring break. So I think I'm just going to do that. So we're, I'm also going to continue to try to get ready for my date tonight with my boyfriend. But yeah, as you guys saw by the title, I have a boyfriend. Friends, if you didn't know, and some of you already knew. Like, probably most of my subscribers already knew I had a boyfriend. But I have lots of makeup. Alright. So I'm just going to kind of tell you guys, like, the brief overview. Because I'm going to try to keep this video very short. But basically, um, in 2018, um, my now current boyfriend and I, Dakota, met at the movie theater Goodness. that we both started working at. It was both of our first jobs, except he had already been there for a year, and I obviously had just started. So we met November of 2018, and instantly became best friends. We're always like hanging out and texting and it was like a lot of fun. Um until a July I think no, probably before then, like probably like May, June. Um he realized that this other guy at work had feelings for me. I had m bigger feelings for Dakota but um i could tell he was backing off so i thought he didn't like me so this other guy and i started dating for just under two years sad why did i do that besides the point and in april 2021 he messaged me and or march april 2021 i don't remember the exact month and said hey this movie theater that we both started working that we both were working at is reopening and we're looking for more people because at this time he was a manager and I was like oh my gosh I loved working there like I would not mind working there again I'm also getting knee surgery so like I needed some job that I could just like easily do would have the ability to sit down and like kind of take it easy on my knee while still making money for college so I went in there, applied, got the job. This was May 17th, 2021. And my first shift was with him. So I was like, oh my gosh, like, we're back together. Like, best friends. Like, oh my gosh, like, I can't believe, like, we're in the same, like, town. Because for, like, a year and a half, not a year and a half, a full year, I was up north at college, seven and a half hours away. So I didn't see him, and then we had COVID before that, so it had been, like, a year and a half, almost maybe two years, it felt like. And I was like, oh my gosh, like, let's hang out, like, let's do stuff. So him and I started talking more, obviously, and we, like, instantly reconnected. Like, no time had passed, it felt like. We were just, like, instantly, like, friends again and, like, hanging out. Um, feelings developed again. And long story short, we ended up dating. Now, you're, some of you are probably like, ding, 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 um, he's your manager. How is this working? So, shift lead, dating a cast member, common, not the big of a deal. We had been friends for, before, so not a big deal. Except for the fact, he was being promoted. This is about two months possibly closer to three by the time papers were finalized that we were dating and I was like okay assistant manager cast member that looks really bad so basically yeah um rumors started at the theater and it was causing a lot of stress on management and like our GM and so we decided to tell our GM so corporate and owners now knew they made the rule stating no 
cast members can know that we're dating. Not a single one. And, like, we didn't want to know what would happen if any of them found out. So we kept it hush-hush. However, there were people that could know who were managers. And they all, we have our, we had all already been friends. Like, it was no big deal. Most, Alec knew. We told Alec because Alec and Dakota were, like, tied at the hip, best friends. So I was like, you know, you can tell him he can be your, like, one person. I didn't have a person. <laughs> I was like, cool. So when the stipulation of, like, hey, managers have to know, Emily and I had already become, like, kind of close. We were getting closer. And then I told her, well, Julie told her, and then we ended up going to Cedar Point. It was, like, me, Dakota, Alec, Ian, Emily. Like, we were all, like, we all went. And it was so much fun and, like, I told her just kind of like how the last couple months had been and it was just like a really fun time and then yeah long story short it just kind of progressed and now obviously I no longer work there I um, found a better job for lack of a better term and I was able to tell people because he also was leaving just shy of like two weeks after I was except he put his months in because he was assistant and he had time to find one and he was just like being generous so he told them shortly after I put my two weeks in coincidentally like I had already been looking for a new job and everything like I just wanted to like leave find a better paying job you know that type of stuff like typical job stuff and I found one put my two weeks in and they were like oh my gosh you guys are both leaving and I was like, obviously, I'm sad. Like, this is, like, my first job. Like, this is where I met my boyfriend and everything. And now I get to go public. So, I'm extremely happy. And this was, like, one of the biggest things for me. I was like, I can tell people I have a boyfriend. Like, I, when I tell you, it, I had a private, private story on my Snapchat that was, like, called, I think I called it Soup's Private because I literally was like, I just want to post you, like, that's like my favorite thing is just being like, boyfriend, and yeah, but nine months later, we're still here, and now I get to make a cute video, so the next couple of clips are pictures and videos and all that type of stuff, so I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> So I just have to remove this, I gotta remove this, and that's it. Are you done? <laughs> ready to go? This is actually decent weather. You ready to go? You ready to go? Yeah? Okay. Is this, is this how you do it? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly it. How do you think we're gonna do today, sir? Oh, I think we're gonna win or lose today. When you and I went no to the <laughs> Hi, best friend. Hi, best friend. Hi, best friend. <laughs> There's two minutes left, and it is 14 13 line. Yes. Tell us how you really feel. What are you going to take the video for YouTube for? 2021. Boom! Two! Hi! Hi! Say hi! <laughs> They did limit the people. Oh. <laughs> Very important question. Who do you think is going to win the Super Bowl? No answer. Okay, who do you think is going to win? No answer. Why not? 
I don't want to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it? You're me. You're dying. You're going to be. Okay. I'll talk to you after the game, okay? Okay. Happy retirement to you.